And so um, let's, let's start off by talking about manager's responsibility. As you build your business and you hire people to manage your business, they have a responsibility and they have to follow your policies and procedures. But the managers are generally given the power and express authority to act for the company by doing some of the following things here. Describing the details of services and products to consumers and others. Explain how the product or services can be attained. They are responsible to collect your fees that you charge for your product. Provide services and products to consumers and clients. Hiring, training, promotion, and enforce progressive discipline. The duties of a manager, that manager you give trust to, to operate and run your business. But I, wanna, I picked one thing on here, and I, it always grabs my attention, and that is progressive discipline. You know, a lot of people don't understand what progressive discipline, and that's the manager's responsibility. As we talk about managers in your business, some managers, their sole purpose in life is to what? Terminate you. The sole purpose in life. But if you are a good entrepreneur and you actually have them to read the policies and procedures, provide educational opportunity for them, they'll see beyond taking someone's job. But progressive discipline, that means to give a verbal warning, suspension, termination. And many of us as employers, employees, we think it, it, it was for design to punish the employee. What it was designed to keep the company from being sued for violation of title. I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here thinking about this. Your race, religious, creed, national origin. So the violation of the EEOC. That was the reason for progressive discipline. So they can say, I gave that person a verbal warning. I gave that person a, uh, 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 a suspension and they repeated the action. Okay, some people, you got to realize something. Some people may need to be terminated if they are completely negligent, but not every person. Sometimes you just have to sit down and coach. And what we do, we fail to coach and then we, go, we resort, resort to, I'm going to terminate you and take your job. You can see I have a passion about people firing people. I'm like, oh, God, you know, because it's taking away someone's livelihood. And it's creating a problem in society. A business should not create problems in society. You should become a steward of the community in which you serve.